Hey guys, I got a new video for you today. And if you've been following my channel for some time, you know that I've been reviewing quite a few different wallets as of late. And in every single one of my videos, I get asked at least once or twice if I'm gonna be reviewing the Combat Wallet by Hellbent Holsters. So while I was at Blade Show this year, I decided to go ahead and pay them a visit. And they were gracious enough to provide me with a couple of them so I can go ahead and test them out, review them, and give you guys my impressions on them. So it comes in this uh, nice little pouch here, and I like this uh, presentation as opposed to just a generic box that it might come in. As you open it up, you're greeted with the wallet itself. As you guys can see, this is the carbon fiber Kydex with the carbon fiber money clip. Now their wallets come in two different sizes. You can have a large size, which will store nine to 12 cards, or you can have a medium size, which will store five to eight cards. This particular one is the larger one. So again, it'll store nine to 12 cards and it'll actually store less than nine cards, but because there will be a little bit of a gap in there, you're gonna have a little rattle on the cards, but it'll still hold them nice and secure. So right off the bat, um, I can tell you that the fit and finish on their wallets is great. Um, anywhere from the rounded corners to the rounded size here is uh, nice and smooth. And again, you want that because this is gonna be in your pocket, so you don't want it to be uncomfortable. Um, it's also a very simplistic design. The folded over Kydex and then molded to fit the cards, it's great. It's not overthought and it does exactly what it's supposed to. Uh, and a couple little extra features definitely make this a great EDC wallet. Now, what I do like about the certain wallets that kind of limit the amount of cards that you can carry is that you end up just carrying exactly what you need and not overloading the wallet or your pockets or anything like that with useless stuff that you're not gonna need. So let's take a look at the wallet all around. So they come with this uh, business card here, which I will talk about in a second. So you have your money clip here. The money clip is removable, and there's a couple different reasons for that. The first one is, if you just wanna go ahead and use a wallet without the money clip, just to store your cards and IDs, you can go ahead and do that. Just load them in there, slide your wallet into your pocket, and you're good to go. Now, the money clip is able to be used on its own. So I just have a couple of bills folded over right here. So you can just go ahead and feed those in there. And now you have a really cool money clip that you can just throw into your pocket. Or in conjunction with the wallet, you can go ahead and slide the money clip back in there and then just slide your cash in there. And now you're gonna have your cash and your cards and IDs all in one place. So as you guys can see, it stores the money in there very nicely. It's easily accessible and you're good to go. Now, this is where the business card comes into play. And again, you just have the Helven Holsters logo on there and then their website on the back, helvenholsters.com. And uh, the way it was explained to me is that certain money clips come under tight tolerances. And they found that sometimes when you're trying to stick your cash in there, it might tear up the cash a little bit. So a good solution is you can go ahead and use this card, just kind of put it on top of the cash and then just slide it underneath the money clip uh, until it goes, uh, it starts to actually wear in. So this is really nice, especially with the titanium money clips that they offer, because again, those are going to be under a little bit more tight tolerances. So that's really cool. Uh, I think it looks cool too. And it's again, very easy to use. You can just slide it out, go ahead and pay. Once you're done, you can go ahead and slide it underneath there and you don't have, you don't have to worry about them shredding up your bills. Uh, onto the card slot. I have a couple cards here, about six of them. Again, this one will hold anywhere from nine to 12, but I wanted to show you guys that it will hold less than that. But again, there is a gap um, because of the missing amount of minimum cards that it will hold. So you will hear a little bit of a rattle in there. But as you guys can see, I'm really shaking this and it's holding the cards in there nice and secure. So if you were to go with a large size um, model, but you maybe don't have as many cards, you don't have to worry. You know, again, you can fluctuate up and down. Now the design to go ahead and get into the cards is one of the really cool things about this wallet. And that's that they use a fanning motion. So basically what you do is in this opening right here, just grab the top card and you can go ahead and fan it down. And then you do that to the next one and the next one and so forth and so on until you get to the card that you want. So obviously, as you guys can see, it is very nice. Again, there is no hidden mechanisms. It's just the way that the wallet is designed. It kind of pinches the cards right down here in this corner and it allows you to go ahead and fan them out and you know get to the card that you need. So again, you can go ahead and do that, pay, and then once you're done, just put the card back in there and you're good to go. 
I wanted to show you guys the one that I've actually been carrying, and it's uh, this one right here. I've been kind of fluctuating between the two, but I find that since I only use about six cards, the medium size model actually uh, served me a little bit well. And this one actually has the titanium um, uh, pocket or money clip in the back with the American flag on there, and it looks really, really cool. Again, this is the carbon fiber kydex. So basically, just um, slides the, slide the cards out of this one, and I'll show you guys how those how these fit into the medium size. Again, it's pretty much the same thing. Just put them back in there. But again, because it's right between the amount that it would normally carry, you know, you don't have that real heavy rattle that you found on the other one. And then because this one does have the titanium clip, I decided to go ahead and use the card. But also because I've been carrying just a couple spare business cards with me. So this is the way that I've been doing. I just put the business cards in, in the back of the cash, the cash, and then the card. And then I just slide that underneath the money clip. And as you guys can see, I have a really nice um, slim form factor. And I just basically have everything in there. I have my cash, my business cards, uh, my IDs and credit cards, insurance information, all in one place. I slide this in my back pocket and I don't have to worry about it uh, being crushed or anything like that. The design is actually um, uh, holding the, the cards and the IDs and all that nice and secure. Um, I just kind of face the, um, the pocket clip to the outside just because it does have that little lip. Um, and then, you know, it faces to the outside. So I actually sit on this portion and it's nice and secure. If I have to get to the cards, I can just go ahead and fan them out until I get to the one that I need. And then, you know, I go ahead and use it. And once I'm done, I just replace it and I'm good to go. So as I mentioned earlier, they do come in a, a quite a few different colors. So, you know, it depends on, on what you're looking for as far as the color of the wallet itself, the size, and then also the uh, money clip. You know, you can get the standard one like this one, um, or you can get a titanium one. And the titanium ones come with a bunch of different designs on them. You know, I'm, I'll go ahead and leave a link below to their website where you can go ahead and order the cards or uh, I'm sorry, order the, um, the wallets. Um, and then um, see the different uh, model pocket clips that they have. That way you can get, you know, the color, the size, and the clip that you want to fit whatever your design is. So there it is. These are the Combat Wallets 2.5 model from Hellbent Holsters. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.